What it is guys, my name is Swifters and today I'm going to be bringing you guys a brand new unlimited money glitch in GTA 5 Online after the 1.15 patch update and all of the most recent hotfixes. For those of you who don't know, all of the previous money glitches that I posted the other day, two days ago, three days ago, all of them are pretty much patched. However, in today's video I'm going to be bringing you guys the best unlimited money glitch after the 1.15 patch update and all of the most recent hotfixes. As always, before this video does get underway, all I ask is that you'd slap that like button and subscribe to my channel for some of the best daily GTA 5 content. With that said, let's get started. Alright guys, so the first thing that you're going to want to go ahead and do is be inside of an invite only session with your friend. You're going to need to be inside of your garage. From here, have your friend buzz in to enter your garage as you do need to have your friend buzz in in order for this glitch to work properly. From here, make your way over to the vehicle that you're going to be selling. In this case, I'm going to be using the Adder, however you guys are more than welcome to use any other vehicle that you would like. You're also going to need to make sure that you set your vehicle access to passengers only, and you're also going to need to make sure that your friend has a job pending on his phone. He can do this by either pulling up his phone and calling one of his contacts, whether it be Lamar or Ron or any of the other characters in the GTA 5 game, have him pull up his phone and call them and request a job. Once he does have a job pending on his phone, you're going to want to have him get inside of the passenger seat, pull up his phone, and as soon as he joins the job, you guys can see in the bottom left hand corner of the screen, you're immediately going to want to drive right outside of the garage. Now from here, simply let the vehicle drive all the way outside of the garage, then turn around and drive right back inside. Once you spawn back inside of the garage, you guys can see that your friend is paused in the passenger seat of the vehicle. From here, what you're going to want to go ahead and do is pull up your phone, go to the internet, go over to the travel and transport tab, scroll down to legendary motorsports, and you're going to need to purchase two allergies and put them inside of your garage. You do need to purchase two brand new allergies, as you cannot do this glitch with already existing allergies inside of your garage. Once you've purchased the allergies, make your way over to the garage management tab, select the adder or the vehicle that your friend is sitting in, and replace it with one of the allergies that has not yet been spawned in. And as you guys can see, the adder has now been duplicated, which you guys can go ahead and do from here is get back inside of the vehicle that has your friend inside and drive it outside of your garage. Once you are outside of the garage, all you're simply going to want to go ahead and do is immediately turn around and go back inside of the garage. From here, make your way over to the garage management tab for a second time, and you're going to want to go ahead and select the vehicle that your friend is sitting in and replace it with the other LRG that has not yet been spawned in. As you guys can see, the adder is not actually going to be spawned in when you duplicate it for the second LRG. However, what you're going to want to go ahead and do from here is get back inside of the vehicle that has your friend inside and drive it outside of your garage. Once you guys are outside of the garage, all you're simply going to want to go ahead and do is wait till you guys receive the little notification in the bottom left hand corner of the screen saying that your allergy has been confirmed as being delivered to your garage. Once you guys do receive that notification, simply drive right back inside of the garage, and as you guys can see, the allergy has now been replaced by the adder, and I now have a garage full of duplicated adders. What you guys can go ahead and do from here is get inside of any of them and take one of them over to Los Santos Customs in order to sell. As you guys can see, I'm able to sell mine for nearly $760,000, so this is an extremely useful unlimited money glitch that hopefully you guys going to be able to use to your advantage in order to make a ton of money in GTA 5 online after the 1.15 patch update. Other than that, that's all we do have for you in today's video. I hope you did enjoy it, and if you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to my channel for some of the best daily GTA 5 content. Until next time, guys, this has been Swifters. I'm out. Peace.